In this video, we'll be seeing how to set up Flutter on your device. Open flutter.dev and click on get started. Here choose the operating system, we'll be going with Windows. Now select the platform for which you are developing the app for, we'll be going with Android. Scroll down and you can see the system requirements. You can see the minimum and the recommended requirements here. Scroll down further and you can see the option to download and install Flutter. Here you can click on this button and download the SDK. Wait for this to complete downloading. Now you have to extract the downloaded zip file. Click on extract and extract this folder here. Now open the extract folder and you will see this folder Flutter. You have to copy this Flutter folder and you can paste it inside the C drive. After copying the SDK folder, you can go inside the Flutter folder, open the bin folder and here we can copy the path from here. So this is the path. So you can copy this path. Now you can search for environment variables. Open this one. And here you can open the environment variable. Click on this option. Now we have to add a path. So you can add that to the system variables. Here you can scroll down and see a option path. Double click and it will open. Here you can add new and paste the path that you have copied and click on OK. Here also you can click on OK and click OK. Here we can type Flutter version and hit enter. Now you can see the version of the Flutter that is installed. So this is the version that we have installed. You can see that here. Now you can also type Flutter doctor and hit enter. Now this will show you if there is any problems with the Flutter installation. You can see that we have to accept the Android license. For that we have to run Flutter doctor Android license this command. Before that we can install this command line tools. To install command line tools you have to open Android Studio. If you don't have Android Studio installed you can come to this URL and simply download this one. You simply have to click next 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 and install. Now Android Studio will be installed on your system. After installing Android Studio you can simply go to this more open the SDK manager and here you can go to SDK tools. Here you can see the option Android SDK command line tools. Simply check this option and click on apply and click on OK here. Now this will download the required files. Click on finish here and you can click on OK here. Now you can run the command flutter doctor. Now we are only having one issue that is to accept the Android license. For that you can run this command. So you can paste this command here and run this. Here you can type Y and hit enter. Here also you can type Y and hit enter. Type Y and hit enter. Y and hit enter. You have to keep on typing Y and accept all the licenses. Now you can see all SDK package license accepted. Now you can run Flutter Doctor once more. Hit enter. Now you can see we are not having any issue. No issues found. So you have to have Android Studio installed. If you don't have VS Code installed, you can install VS Code. Simply come to this URL and uh, you can click on download for Windows and it will start the download. You simply have to complete the download and install this VS Code. If you are having any warnings with connected devices, you can simply create an emulator on Android Studio and uh, that will be gone. Now you can create a new project for that you can open the directory in which you wish to create a new project and uh, we can open command prompt from here. Type cmd here and hit enter. Now the command prompt will open in that specific directory. Now here we can type the command flutter create and the project name and it will create a new flutter project for you. Now the flutter project is created. You can uh, change the directory to cd and the project name. So run this command. Now you will be inside the project directory. You can see that here. Now you can run this project using the command flutter run. Before running you can open android studio and uh, select this virtual device manager. You have to create a new virtual device. You simply can create it using this plus icon and you can create your virtual device. If you don't have virtualization enabled on your system, you have to enable it. Create a virtual device and you can click on this play. Wait for this to launch. You can see that the emulator is up and running. You can type flutter run and hit enter. If you are getting an option to select the device, you can select the device here and it will choose that device to run the app. Now you can see that the app has launched. You can see this is the demo app. You can see you can click on this button and the number changes here. So that's how you can install and set up Flutter and how to set up an emulator to run the Flutter application. Hope you understand how to set up Flutter on your device. If you have any doubt, you can leave a comment below. I'll be responding to them. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more such videos.